Hello everyone and welcome to The Forest. This is Matt from Indefensive Plants and we're out here on this beautiful early spring day enjoying the nice weather, celebrating geophytes. Do you not know what that is? Well, join us and find out. So a geophyte is any plant with a short seasonal lifestyle and some sort of underground storage organ, like a bulb, tuber, or a corm. Not unlike these little spring beauties we see right here. Now the interesting thing is when geophytes are doing most of their growth. For as excited as we get about spring weather, it's actually a very tough time of year for plant growth. Because of this, geophytes have opted for growing as rapidly as possible. Now to pull this off, they actually preform all of their organs during the winter months. Believe it or not, they're growing while there's snow on the ground. What's more, the cells and the tissues that they grow during that time are huge. And in that way, they don't have to bother with rapid cell division. Instead, they just pump their cells full of water. It's pretty remarkable, and you can actually see signs of it all over the landscape during this time of year if you look close enough. Let's go see if we can find some of them. Now this little patch of bluebells here is proving my point really well. It's already got flower buds fully developed. All they need is the water to get going. Now another interesting fact about geophytes is that a disproportionate amount of species have huge genomes. Huge genomes would actually be kind of a detriment if they had to go through rapid cell growth. It's really hard to coordinate all of that division of chromosomes. But in geophytes, again, all they need is to pump those large cells full of water. Now the large genome probably isn't a coincidence. In fact, it may actually be beneficial. In fact, they found that associated with large genomes are expression of genes that create large stomata. And large stomata help plants regulate water a lot easier. And again, if we go back to what we had said earlier, they need to pump their cells full of a lot of water to get all of that preformed tissue up and above, ready to photosynthesize and go through their life cycle. So large genomes may actually be helping these plants survive this geophytic life cycle even better. It's pretty remarkable, and they're some of my favorite plant species to see come spring. 